like to have pots that have distinct features. This is going to be a fairly simple pitcher, but I still want it to have a distinct foot, a fairly distinct rim, uh, and then we'll work on the spout and the handle later. There is a little bit of extra clay down here at the bottom, and I want to give it a foot. I don't want to trim it, but I want it to have a, have a feature that we can consider a foot. So what I'm going to do is use this plastic rib that has a right angle and come down here near the bottom and actually push down a little bit on the outside of the clay and I'm going to make a little flange that sticks out against the, the bat down here at the bottom of the pot. And what I'll do in a minute once I finish forming the pitcher I'll roll this flange back up and it'll become the foot of the pot. So I'm done throwing the pot, meaning I'm not pulling any more clay. This, at this stage, I'm just working on the shape. This is gonna be a simple, very simple shape. So the first thing I'm doing is smoothing out the throwing marks. I have a rib on the inside and a rib on the outside. I just want the focus to be on the shape of the pot and not any surface texture. So I'm getting rid of the surface texture with the ribs. Okay, now I'm going to use this tool. It's basically a pointy wooden stick. And I'm going to roll the foot of the pitcher back into the side of the pot. So to do that, I'm going to undercut it with the, with the stick and lift it up at the same time using a wet sponge and press it into the wall of the pot. It's really a pretty simple way to make a, a foot on a cylinder. 